All right, so I want to tell you guys right now, the first part uh, did a lot better than I expected. Welcome back to more Kena Bridge of Spirits. This has been an awesome game so far. I'm glad I didn't turn off the sound either, because that would have been probably awkward. Can you imagine playing like Doom Eternal with no music? I would be devastated. <laughs> It'd be, be a whole different game. But anyways, you guys are awesome. You want more of this game, just destroy that like button. Right, let's get it, guys. Good thing about this game, the load times are non-existent. Definitely uh, gets you back in the action a lot faster. All right, we're good. So right now we're still trying to get to this house, which is, I think that's it up there. I'm assuming that's the house we're going to. It's the only thing that stands out on the side of the mountain. I mean, it's not even on the side, it's on the very top. I would not live there, ever. A lot of people said there was some similarities between this game and a lot of like Pixar and DreamWorks stuff, which I actually agree. I think I even mentioned that in the first video. Definitely a nice vibe. I think if I hop down here, I slide, maybe? Hold on. Can you go up here? No? Alright. Here we go. Oh, no. Saw the waterfall in the background. I was like, is this the end? Now, I'm assuming I shouldn't go that way, right? It's like, I can't go that way. Okay. Let me just hop down here and see what happens. Oh, instant death. Never mind. All right, let's see where we gotta go. Now, according to this, we gotta we we should be going like this way, but there's nothing back to loop around everything. Yeah, we have to like cut through, I guess. Cause I see some white parts where you can grab on the other side. So I don't, let me go across again. I can't make this jump. It's impossible. Um, oh, hold on. Well, I don't know where I'm supposed to, like... I can't make these jumps without... Let's go around this side. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Wait a minute. They were about to do something right there. Man, the rot are so funny to me. Oh my god. No, oh, we're good. Alright, here we go. Hey, there's one right here. I think. Oh, that must just be the outfit I have for him. Forgot you can, like, have those. Okay, I think we're supposed to go down right here. Oh dear. Uh, maybe not, actually. That wouldn't make sense to go that way. This goes around, though. Look at this. It looks like you can grab right here. There we go. It's like the white border. Here we go. Here we go. Progress. We can do this, guys. I believe. I gotta admit, this game has definitely caught me by surprise as far as, like, the fun factor. The world, the atmosphere. I don't know. It's just a good game. I wonder if this is considered a true PS5 title because I think it's on PC as well and it's also on PS4 so it's not really an exclusive and usually when it's a Sony exclusive I have to get the game from Sony I got this straight from Ember Labs so um, definitely made me think all right we got to cross Look at those waterfall man those water physics though all right here we go Something tells me we should be... I bet you there's a secret. Hold on. There shouldn't be all this extra stuff, right? Hold on. Can I hop down? Grab ledge. All right. We got a couple things here. Hold on. I'm going to go around this side because it looks like there will be something over here, right? Like, why else would this be here? Unless this is the right way to go. And I feel like it is. Okay. Well, let me go get whatever's over here. I feel like this is the critical path, not the other side. Alright, we're good. Let's see what's up here. This has to just be like a hidden thing, I would imagine. Unless I got him completely backwards. See, I don't know. I'm torn. It's like... 
the other side felt like something hidden, I could have gone there, but... Alright, easy does it. Should be good. Uh, can you actually make that jump? I don't know if you can. Okay, yeah, you can. Definitely underestimated the jump there. Alright, we made it around. I wonder what was on the other side now. I'm torn. It's like I want to go back and check it out. But I guess maybe there's just two ways to get across. It is what it is. We shall return to it later. There she is. Hmm. I would be around this side, I guess. Where's yeah, I think there's just an extra way. Maybe the rock can help. Uh, use okay. rock. Hey, let's go. Hurry, I don't think they can hold it for long. Alright, we're going. We're out of here. Now, did they get across too? Usually they teleport everywhere, so I don't know. Interact. This pack is tiny. It looks like it could have belonged to one of the children. Hmm. Trying just to see what we'll, if there's anything else down there, maybe. You know, we're actually getting really close. The lookout is... I don't know if that was it or not. The thing that we saw. Oh, no. What is this? That corruption is powerful. There must be a relic nearby. I need to find another way around. The forest has become too dangerous to all. The village is the safest place for you. If you hurry, you can make it back before sundown. I'll come for you when my work here is done. Nice. Hmm. This feels like it's about to be a boss fight. Let's see what's over here. It's like an extra path back here. I'm assuming we can come here later on too. Let me check something. All right, sorry. I was actually just checking. I wanted to check the controls because I, I think you do get a bow later on. If I had to guess. Yeah, it's all like it's all like in a preview or something. I believe. I could be wrong though. All right, fast travel point unlocked. Because like this map is huge, man. I'm guessing you can go all the way up here. Where let's see how high up it goes. Okay, it stops there. Haven't looked at the timetable in this game. I don't know how how lot, like long the story is. Um, obviously, it seems like you're kind of doing a bunch of side stuff early on, because uh, it kind of just drops you in the world, you know. Uh, let me go. What about this area back here? Let, let me just go check it really quick. Probably this is gonna be a boss area, or oh my god, what is that? Hold on. Oh, these enemies look ridiculous, and I love it. Let's see if it had any AOE effect, and it does not. It's, it is tough to control both. I should have went over here to this other side. Let me use this one. There we go. First one down. Let's go. There we go. Oh, that's like a just frame type. Thing. I like that. Uh, I could use a rod on that. Let me... Oh, wait. I just confuse him for a minute. For no reason. This enemy should give me full bar. Yep, there we go. Alright, here we go. Alright, the major one has opened. 
essentially what each of these battle areas is about. All you're kind of doing is just getting through and uh, building up your rot meter, I guess you want to call it that. The running attack breaks that as well. Interesting. Where you can uh, disintegrate all these pretty much. There we go. We good? Let's use rot. What is this? Oh, hold on. Um, I think we have to put this here to weigh it down, and then from there we can go through there. Cause I don't. I think if we leave it, let's see if it's heavy enough. Oh, wait a minute. There's got to be more than one. Hmm. Well, if that's not where it goes, then let me look around. Let me scan this up here really quick. I didn't do anything. All right. I don't know if this is heavy enough. Okay. It needs a little more weight. I'm assuming there's another one of these somewhere. Maybe there's one back here I can bring to it. That almost reached. Um, see how it almost gets all three? Yeah, I have to be able to have these on there so I can scan. Oh, I just realized what you need to do. Never mind. I'm an idiot. Hold on. <laughs> I, uh, I just figured it out. Rather than having it there, I think you want to put it, like, over here. Because it looks like it echoes off of each crystal. And by putting it there, it'll reach all those. All right, Brad, you got this. Here we go. This should work. Ricochet. Yep. Man, I can't believe I was about to walk away. Interesting. When I realized it was only one, I was like, something's got to give here. Then I saw it kind of echo for a second, and I was like, hmm. With no running start, Brad. Good job. I cannot see anything. Oh, my God. Hold on. I'm about to do that first. <laughs> I haven't looked at reviews for this game. They were very, uh, I guess, hush-hush about giving out early copies and everything. So I, I don't know. Like, sometimes it's a good sign. Sometimes it's a bad sign. I heard it was mainly just because they wanted to protect the story, you know? I almost fell through. That ain't good. Kappa. <laughs> I like the name. Alright, we gotta figure out what is probably going to be best here. Assuming it pops up in one of these three spots. Oh, little minions. Hey, buddy. Okay, I feel like maybe... Oh, that did some good damage. It's like whack-a-mole. A thing in the old ar arcades. Back in my day. I'm so old now. There we go. Not a tough boss fight so far, but... Except the fact that, uh... There's gotta be a way I can stun. Hold on, use the rot. We go. Oh, that soundtrack is bumping right now. Over here? No. Guy, I really don't want you to get close. Oh, that's some big damage. Let's go. Ow, come on. If I can use my rot, that would be amazing. Yeah. 
On the mark. I did a good bit of damage. I'll take it. I'll count it as a win. What the? Oh, no. Ooh. Oh, my God. What in the world? How am I supposed to fight against that? Oh, wow. This is going to be a lot tougher now. I'd rather the running attack any day of the week. Ow. That almost killed me. My chance, guys. Very cool fight, man. Very cool. That's the thing, like... I don't know what's considered, like, an actual... Like, main enemy, main area... Versus, like, this felt like a side thing I needed to do. You know? What is up here, I wonder? I can search here. There we go. That's a lot. Let's get it. The shop hasn't really opened up in this game yet, so it's like I I only buy like little hats. <laughs> it's like kind of weird. I don't know. Hey, let's go. Took me a second on the puzzle, but after I've kind of figured out what I needed to do, since everything kind of, I guess, transitions from one thing to the next with the, uh, hey, hey there we go. It. I think we found Mr. Russo. Come on, this way. Oh, this was the right way to go. Can you pick that up? Still don't know what lifting these up does, but. Hmm. All right. I really enjoy this game. My voice just kind of cracks. I'm kind of embarrassed right now. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. It's, uh... This game has been just, like, tremendously... I guess, crafted. There's no wasted downtime, you know? Hey, Mr. Rusu! We've been looking for you! We brought our friend Kena. She's here to help Toro. The power of the mountain shrine is connected to everything in this forest. The trees here grew strong, drawing on its energy. And the land was once in perfect balance. But like all things, the mountain shrine follows a natural cycle. One that our village struggled to understand. As the shrine's power began to fade, devastating famine struck our village. Taro lost his parents, and he was left to take care of Benny and Saya. I should have done more to help Taro, and now I can only watch as his spirit struggles. We can still help Taro, Rusu. There's a relic covered by the corruption at your house, but I need a way to break through. That weapon you carry, I sense it holds a deeper power. The staff belonged to my father. It's been in our family for generations. He must have been a great spirit guide. I may be powerless against the corruption, but I can teach you a new way to fight it back. To a trained archer, the bow is simply an extension of the body. A 
Spirit Guide staff is no different. Ground yourself. Feel the energy of the mountain. Draw on its power. Yo, let's get it. Targets. When you are finished, feel free to practice at the other stations I've set up. I knew it was gonna get a bow. As long as I saw the little like, oh yeah, and it it's just like I expected. Perfect. Oh, you can fill the uh, adaptive triggers on this thing, man. Back again. I'll toss up another set of targets. I don't really need to. I don't know why I interacted like that. I should just shot him and been done with it. All right, here we go. Okay, it looks like the bowls come back. Yeah, it's like it just takes time. Okay, I think we're good. Yo, so this is actually well worth it, and this was the right thing. Interesting. Can you pick that up? Hey, okay, so it does give me some of that Some of the upgrade I guess rot it increases it. Um, I did get this but I just I Don't know using it versus just distracting I feel like I would do more damage But Then again, I don't know how much damage that actually is doing um, We got this for the bow you can slow down time. I feel like that's gonna be yeah, let me get that That's actually huge. I Don't know what the last area is gonna be so we got the bow uh, the little parry, I guess. That actually looks awesome. Need to get that next. Alright, I think we're good. Uh, clear the corruption. I'll get the house. Imagine if I could just hop off right here. Wing suit to the bottom. That'd be nuts. I'm gonna, okay, yeah, this actually, if you look right here, we're gonna go this way. Kind of loop around, let's go down through here, come out right there. Okay, makes sense. Guess it won't be put up against enemies that have, I guess, flying enemies now, right? Now we got the bow. Focus is critical. Fully draw the bow, and your arrows will be more powerful. Pull the lever to drop the targets. See if you can hit them before they reset. Is that necessary? I guess I could try, right? Oh no, get back up here. It's actually worth it. I got a lot of stuff too. I like how the bows recharge. Like, I was worried about ammo at first, but I guess everything just kind of regenerates your, your health out of combat also. Here we go. Oh, it's another one. Over there. I don't know what this is going to be like. Controller aim's a little rough for me. Hat cart discovered. Maybe each one has different stuff. New rot hat available. Yeah, I don't know. Like, look at the cost of these versus, like, I got 665. I'll do two of each. Uh, actually, hold on. Golden rot. So I need four more. So let's do. Let me shop again. I guess each one will just have. So if I need four more, I'll do one of each. Uh. Why can't I equip? Oh, the clover's part of it. That's fine. I didn't even think about that. Two out of three. So I have extra of those. 
So when I get new ones, they'll be good to go. That is pretty cool, though. I wish these did something, you know? What is all this stuff down here? There's, like, nothing there, really. All I know is when something does pop up that costs a lot, I'll be ready, at least. All right, let's get moving. All right, we're going around Rot Hat Cart. Wait, we could actually go back up there. I don't know what that is. I guess you can kind of stick to the critical path if you like. What is over here? Oh, this is the right way. So what is back right here? Hold on. This lo loops around, I think. Yeah, yeah. I think we're good. Um, wait, what is this? Oh, it's a lever right there. I think we'll be fine. Manifestations of corruption patrol the path ahead. Your bow should help clear the way. Since we're about to be sliding down here, hold on. Uh, yeah, this is the right way. Oh god. You mean to tell me it does that much damage? Actually insane. That is a lot of damage. Thought I could shoot him for a minute. What? Let's see what's over here. Let me pick up the statue. I guess after combat, maybe. Okay. I want to try this slam really quick. Hold on, let's do it. I haven't really done that yet. Just wanted to check it out. There we go. Easy does it. Hey, let's go. Can you pick that up? I love how this game is like developed. It just seems like they really put a lot of care into everything. There we go. Let's get it. The game is just smooth, too. I haven't noticed any lag. Um It's gonna be a little like warp point. Let me just get this on there. I don't know if I, like, interact with it actually matters. I don't think you need to. Um, I just wanted to make sure it was on the map. We can go this way. There's something right there. Hold on. I was going to interact and talk to him, but... Hold on. Oh, I'm not going to make it. That's fine. The good thing is you can just respawn like nothing happened. This broken path leads to my house. Corruption there is powerful. Be careful, Kena. Kena. I think I put too much pause when I say it. I'm like, Kena. <laughs> I gotta be cautious. Hold on, let's see. Uh, maybe. No, that wasn't. I mean, it makes sense to just run straight across, right? But this is the part I don't know about because. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, what in the world? What was that? Meditation, spot discovered. Rest here permanently increases your max health. Oh, that is awesome. Now that I know these exist, I will be using these often. All right, we should be good. Um, I'm assuming to get back, we just shoot this. Now that we know that that's how you do it, that's really awesome. Alright, that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want more of this game, just destroy that like button. And I'll catch you guys in the next part.
Take it easy, guys.